And you know what? Oh, never mind. About that, I was going to find you a special locker, but I don't need to. It just goes into a sequence, doesn't it? I think I glitched the game a little bit there by um, skipping that cutscene. Right then, so let us equip the correct uniform. Camouflage, doesn't matter about the face, because it goes into officer. There we go. So, as per request of Nor no uh, Norwegian Wolf, let's try kick these lockers. At least the locker doors don't follow me like they did in Metal Gear Solid fucking 2. Can't fucking... That door's indestructible. Does it open though? It's not a lass, is it? It's a dude. It looks like a fucking lass. Especially like, say, with way that... It's, it's, not, it's not a lass because... Lasses don't wear, like, fucking speedos with lightning bolts on and shit like that, so... Definitely a dude. It was weird, though. What's happening? What happened there? Weird. Like, what, 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 did, what did Norwegian Wolf say? He said, um... If you punch the lockers, they open a woman's special uniform. Hmm. I've punched a, 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 a fairly decent amount of lockers here, dudes, but nothing, nothing seems to be dropping. Nope. Get punching that motherfucker. There we go. Is that gonna? Oh, it does fall on you the same. When I saw that last one following, like, whoa, man, maybe, wait a minute, maybe it does fall in still. No, 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 no. I'm sure there's more goodies in here now that I'm punching the lockers open rather than opening them. Yeah, for some reason, dude, I can't fucking... There's no extra uniform. Nope. Oh, well. People wanted me to call the, um, the crew as well. Like, Major Zero and shit. See what he's got to say about ah, it. Ah, your Rykov disguise has turned out nicely. Yeah, not even his own mother could tell the difference. Indeed, you're starting to irritate me already. Why? This look should make me more popular. I wouldn't bet on it, but whatever. Now that you're indistinguishable from the real Rykov, you'll be able to get into the West Wing, to which only Volgin and Rykov have access. Head for the west wing of the weapons lab. That's where Sokolov is being held. Enter the main wing from the second floor of the east wing. Pass west through the main wing, and you'll come to a connecting passageway. The west wing is at the other end of that passageway. Fair enough. Infiltrate the west wing and rescue Sokolov. Oh, people are saying in the stream chat that apparently it, you got to come back after the torture sequence later on, and then you can get the, um, the uniform. Fair enough. You got some instant noodles, huh? Instant noodles. Uh huh. It was invented in Japan just recently. Oh yeah, we've heard, we, yeah we've heard that one before about the instant noodles. What's Sigan got to say? No, not healing radio. Sigan. You say Granin's shoes were rigged with a transmitter? That sounds like something the KGB's been working on lately. It's exactly like you described—a miniature transmitter that's small enough to put in a shoe. Granin said he got the shoes from a woman called Tatiana. You think she's a KGB spy? Could be. Or maybe it's some kind of ploy to throw suspicion on her. Hmm. Anyway, it's your job to find out. Good point. Don't need to save. Eva's not going to respond. Okay. okay. Your Rykov disguise is complete. Now they won't stop you no matter what you do. Even if I punch someone in the face? Right. Oh. Really? Really? See, that would have <laughs> yeah, been helpful. Rykov's just that kind of... I know you guys told me as well, like, but... Once you're disguised Not, it, as Rykov, I didn't realize it was like to the point of being able to punch people, you know. <laughs> to get to the entrance to I thought it was just like don't bump into folk. West I didn't realize it's like do what the, the fuck you please to them. And go through the connecting passageway. You can get into the main. Oh, so, sorry, Eva. I, I, I'm sorry to be rude and cut you off last night, but now that I, look, what the fuck? 
Very strange. Um, now that I know I can go punching guards and shit like that. See, look, I'm, I'm fast pass, fast pass to these fucking guard slurs. Sir. Forgive me for troubling you, sir. <laughs> I can do whatever I like to. Oh, you see, I, I was busy like. You see, now I know what I thought we were saying, like, you know, like, th the one time where he doesn't need to be patient, and he is. It's like, I didn't realize you could just, like, bump through him. <coughs> crawl underneath him. Forgive me for troubling you, sir. Punch the absolute <coughs> fuck out of them. Whee! There he goes. <coughs> Sweet, unretaliatable revenge. Unretaliatable? Mm. Forgive me for troubling you, sir. What else can we do? What else can we do? Um, oh, the handkerchief gun. Let's give that a try. Handkerchief with knockout medicine. See, it's not a bit. Why's it got bullets for it then? <laughs> I hit him with a fucking chloroform handkerchief. One shot down. Should be doing that in future. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, oh, what the fuck? Uh, but no, I didn't know we were gonna do that. I knocked myself out by waving a fucking chloroform handkerchief in front of me at first. I guess it, it makes sense, like, but still. All right, fella. Keep up the fine work. Keep up the fine work, sir. Keep up the fine work, sir. Allow me to clean your face. Oh. He was so amazed by my face cleaning, he passed out. Fair enough. I don't know. Why am I collecting all this shit? Because I've not gotten anything new from doing all this. Hey, up, oh, Scorpion Submachine Gun. I've got something new from doing this. Why didn't I pick that up before? Well, I, I guess I may as well, uh, fucking hell, uh, fair enough, I may as well just um, skip through the cutscenes and um, carry on from there. I think I've got everything in this area. Got everything in that area. I was if I missed a fucking weapon before. Mousetrap. Yeah, I, li I like all the new different weapons in this. Pretty funny. Handkerchief fucking weapon. Hey, I don't think I've been in here. I've never been in here before at all. Books. Ooh. An actual book. Oh. Hello. That That's not the curt response. What are you shivering for? What are you scared for? I saluted you. What have you been, been like that for? Unless you're smart and you know that I ain't real. What's wrong with you, fella? What's wrong with you? Let me wipe the dirt off you first. No, wait, I've got a belt. No, let's... You not gonna say no? No. Can't grab him. That got him? Nope, he's still... It's, you you, you get, up some, get up for some more, then. Get up for some more. No, no more. Give me a goodie. There we go. Scientists always have ointment on them. I knew it. Any goodies around here? That's surprising. You think there'd be a little box of ammo or something? This room seems like there should be something to it. Other than just books. I guess, I, I don't know. have got Metal Gear magazines and shit like that. You've got Spiel film. TV Spiel film. It got Metal Gear Solid 3 on it, but yet they're announcing Metal Gear Solid 4. What's that about? As if they'd already planned for- obviously they'd already planned for Metal Gear Solid 4 when they made Metal Gear Solid 3, but... And you got KGP, what's that? Kojima Pop? 14 Taj? Die... 
something. Film... Krilken? I don't know. I apologize for my German, man. I don't know what that word is. Some fine reading in here. Now, have they hidden anything extra nice around here? Nope, same shit. Hey, you get a bargain for magazines. Look at this. Look at the thickness. Look at the thickness of the magazines in the Metal Gear Solid universe. There's some fucking strange shit in Metal Gear, but not as strange as the magazine size that you buy. Wow, it's like a book. It's huge. You could injure somebody with a magazine in this fucking game. Something seems off in this room. I don't know, like, I don't know. It seems like there'd be a moving book. I think there's just too many games and too many films. Like, every time you see a bookcase, you expect that you can, like, press a button. You know, like, pull a book out of it and, like, something opens up. But I think that's everywhere I explored. And I beat the shit out of the guards. I can't grab them, unfortunately. I wish I could. I handkerchief them. Sir. Any other suggestions on how to beat the shit out of the guards and make it a very... Very rough day for these guys. I mean, they're only doing the job. Might be on the wrong side, but they're only doing the job, but... Rough day for these guys. What if I went into a box? Forgive me for troubling you, sir. Huh? Who's that? Oh, fuck me! <laughs> What are you doing? No, no, no. Well, I'm not taking much damage in the officer uniform. I was an officer inside a box. I was an officer box. A boxifer. So why the fuck? Why the fuck did they see me? I have to wait, dickheads. Boo! Oh, outside? Oh, I'm rumbled now. He didn't, he, he didn't say... Oh, oh, no, I can't get into this locker. This locker will do. Major! What? What, 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 what? What? Mission failed! Why? Stay! What's going on? Stay! Stay! Why? So I've got my uniform now? Oh, at least I, oh, at least I, I got to restart it there. That's not too bad. At least we can go back outside. <laughs> so we just said that I guess the real Rykov don't play with um, boxes. I didn't know that. I thought everybody liked boxes. Of course, what I did there is not suspicious and not neither. Hello, douchebag. Can I grab you? Thank you, sir. Thank you. When did you drop Thank your gun? You, sir. You're useless now. Look, look, your gun just disappeared. You're useless. Thank you, sir. I just wish there were a way of, like, you know, strangling them and stuff like that. Like, speak and sh shit. You, know, you just can't do that. Keep up the fine. Keep up the fine work Keep of beating the, the shit out of poor grunts. Ooh, goodies. My food's full. I'll come back. I remember you. Let me out. Underground passage. What's this lead to? There's a rat down there. She would have a fork. Uh, no, not that way. Let's try this way. Which way am I going? Which way am I going? This down forward. Right. Jeez. Jeez. All right, rat. I'm not gonna do that to you, fella. I actually do have a spare cage, seems like that frog was so fucking useless. Maybe I should catch him. Yeah, I'm gonna catch him. No, I'm not. I have to do- no, I have to de-equip my uniform, fuck it. You can't use CQC in disguises. Fair enough. Makes sense. Fair enough. Where am I going, man? What is this? This is some like extra way of doing that because it, it seems like there's always different ways of approaching the stealth. Maybe it was a different way of doing it. Broop. Just reposition the high eye camera. 
Do you mean I can't go any more to the left than that? Well, that sucks. That'll do though, I think. Yes. Oh no. I, 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 oh, I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to press. I don't want to actually like move the camera itself. But there we go. That's a bit of a better view of high there. Washing away. Hey, darling. You washing away? You a clean cat? You are. You're pretty clean. Shall I leave you to it? I'll leave you to it, darling. That's a good girl. So I don't know what you want, but if you ain't coming to me, I ain't coming to you, bloody cats. Thanks for all the awesomeness with the Metal Gear Solid playthroughs. Cheers from Kringles. Oh, thank you very much, dude. Very generous. Thank you very much. I'm glad folk are enjoying it. Me too. Me too. Like I say, I've been a bit like, oh, to be completely fair, I've actually been, what's this? I'm not zoned, oh, I guess, oh, go on, fuck it, we'll zone out. Been a bit fucking knacked the past week. Not been able to fucking stream or record, no. It's like I was saying right at the beginning of this set, if I can't give it 100%, I, would, I don't stream. I mean, I did last stream, but that's only because it's like, I just wanted to play more and stream more, but... It, it, it was rough last time, it was rough, so I'm like, no, nah, I've got to fucking get sorted out first. Not via the doctors, oh, don't, don't even get me started though, don't even get me started. I think I already had a whinge in one of the earliest sets about fucking appointment times nowadays. I do hope that in a few years time, it's going to take more than that, you know, like in five or ten years time, I can watch this back and go, oh, I fucking remember, I remember all the doctor's Sir. problems back then. Not like that now though. Something tells me I will not say that. Hit him. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. That's all the fucking sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. May I have another one, sir? But yes, thank you very much, Kringles. Like I say, glad you're enjoying it, dude, and glad sir. other people seem to be as well. Thank you, sir. It was long overdue. Long overdue with Metal Gear Solid 2 and 3. 2 especially. Like, if it had not done 3 for another year or something like that, I think people have been like, oh, well, fair enough. But... I thought, fuck it. Like I say, folk have been great for, for a long time, but especially so recently. And, um... I, I, I finished two and I'm like, you know, I, I want to do three now. I want to do three. And here we are. You're alright. Suck it up. Punch you. And I'm going to punch you. So just kind of like pissing around with the guards and hovering at good is now. It's, like, it, it's, it's quite nice to be able to do something different. Completely immune. What's this? Where am I going? I'm get Not only do I get to see the entire area that I just ran through pretty much or stealth through before, kind of, half and half. Pick up all the goodies and shit as well. Let's say cheers to that, dudes. Pardon me, sir. Pardon me, you've got a different thing. I would have not have known to run back through here and stuff like that. I wouldn't have thought of that. I think, like I said, I think the stream chat works out really well, man. I mean, this is why I like, uh, this is why I've taken HD step over to Twitch. Not only is it more welcome on Twitch, but the, um, the stream interaction has a, a nice, nice element to it. And everybody's pretty good with spoilers and shit like that. Like, I'm amazed that nobody said, like, you do realise that's, that's either OTG. It's like, no, I did not. I did not know that. I've never felt spoiled so far. Oh, I've ended up doing a full loop, pretty much. I think that'll do, though, won't it, dudes? I think that'll do. Sir. 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 You, 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 salute. Good man. And you. Sir. There we go. Hey, a minute. Did I go in back of this? I don't think I did. Ha-ha! Aha. I'm full on everything, unfortunately. Right, let's just make sure we've got all the items in here, and we shall progress back to the torture sequence. And then move forward. Is there a torture sequence in every Metal Gear game? Because there has been so far, from the ones that I've played, 1, 2, and 3 all have a torture sequence. That's way, dickhead. Coming through. I think we've got all the goodies in that. What the fuck? I was stuck to the side of the wall there. I didn't get all the items, now I have. Take that, take that. So full on shit. Don't know why. Well, full of shit, but 
full of actual fucking gutters. Here we go, dudes. Like, obviously, we're going to skip through the secrets this time. And I meant to say as well, apologies if I ever skip any of the, you know, the, like, press the right button to get first person view kind of um, sequences. I missed a couple. I apologize. It was not intentional. Between having a look over at stream chat. Cats always distract me. But, but it's mainly the stream chat and then looking back at the game. Even though it's obviously like English localization for the dialogue and shit like that. Oh, here we go. Food full. That'll do. Even though it's English dialogue, I still read the actual text. So I'm reading the text of the game and then I'm reading the stream t chat text. And in the top right corner, I don't even see. I don't even see it. I apologize. Um, calorie, mate. Go on then. That's damn good. Damn good. Russian. Russian, Russian. Right, here we go, dudes. I, like I said, I apologize for the, um, for the big delay there. That was like half an hour, but folk wanted it. I wanted to see it. So it's like, well, go on, let's do it now then. Let's do it now. And also, uh, call it, uh, let's, let's just clear up the codex screen as well. Let's make sure there's no um, extra codex things to be heard. Because like I said, you can only do this bit once. Ah, your Rykov just. Yep, read that one before. While you're disguised as Rykov, you can press the action button to perform a salute. If you want, why don't you try saluting some of the soldiers and scientists? The scientists get scared. As long as you're disguised as Rykov, you'll be able to go anywhere in the fortress, and no one will suspect a thing. Now may be a good time to do a little exploring around the place. Yeah, that was pretty good. But I'm full on items, so uh, it had limited of use, but... As long as you're... Okie dokie. Paramedic. You got some instant noodles? Oh no, not the instant noodles again. She's gonna talk about food, isn't she? What's Sigan? You say Gran and shoes were... Ah, no, no, no. Sigan. Sigan. Yo! Eba said she set up a ground effect vehicle for us to make our escape. I don't think we've heard this one. So I heard. The ground effect vehicle, or WIG, is something like a cross between an airplane and a boat. It uses ground effect to fly. Ground effect basically means that when the craft skims the surface of the ground, the air between the ground and the wing is compressed, which gives the wing an extra boost. From what Western intelligence agencies have been able to gather, the Russians are pretty serious about developing these WIGs. <laughs> Apparently, they're planning on using them for anti-submarine patrols. I guess I can see why. The WIG's long cruising range and high-speed capabilities make it a good choice for that kind of mission. Eva must have gotten her hands on one of the first prototypes while it was being field-tested as a transport craft. The WIG has a top speed of over 400 miles per hour, and its range is pretty good, too. Not that speed is going to help you if you've got a supersonic fighter jet on your tail, but if you hug the surface and stay off the radar, you should have no problems getting away. Yeah, I heard that about Metal Gear Solid 4. Like, the, the cutscene length is just epic. Like, so long. I mean, because that cutscene we had with the torture scene, like, you know, before I just reset back. That, I, I consider that to be a pretty long, obviously like half an hour of dialogue. I mean, I like it, like it's all the story and stuff and it's cinematic and shit. But, you know, that's that's a long cutscene. Well, try double it in a half and then that's apparently what a Metal Gear Solid 4 cutscene is. Was Tonk saying 71 minutes? It's like, what? That is long. That's a movie in a game is that thing. And it wasn't, I mean, from what I've gathered, it's not 71 minutes of cutscenes over the entirety of Metal Gear Solid 4. It's a 71 minute cutscene period. One. A completed prototype. Damn, son. That's a lot. So you, all I wanted. Um, we don't, yes, actually, we do need to, well, could save any time, like, but we'll, we'll save anywhere. I'm a bit more gooded out here and got that scorpion and shit. There we go. Right. Right, Bon. <laughs> Unfortunately, guys, I couldn't rewatch all of those cutscenes for the. Um... Oh, I can't skip this. Who have you been talking to? I apologize, dudes. You 
Better start talking. Please, stop this! <clears throat> Who is Khrushchev's lapdog? How can you do this to him? I know you gave the data to someone. Never do it. You! <laughs> Still gonna play Metal Gear Solid 4 at some point, though. God knows when. I have learned quite harshly over the fucking years. I have plans for games to play and shit. Yeah, no worries, but don't say when or how or why. I guess he's dead. I think this in the Peace Walker to go through before four as well. Unless I'm playing him in the or no, yeah, yeah, the Peace Walker to go through, wasn't there? And then four. I mean, that's what I'm assuming that like, the acceptable is that an acceptable order? I went Metal Gear Solid one, two, three, and then go to Peace Walker. And then do something like Revengeance, and then do Metal Gear Solid 4, or... F Unacceptable. Claire doesn't know. Claire doesn't know. Let's take a look at your body, shall we? Claire has never felt the joy of being hidden You're under a, a box. Tough one, my friend. A lesser man would be dead by now. <laughs> this ought to be interesting. Well then, let's get started. What is your target? I assume is I can skip the next bit, but not, 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 not this one, unfortunately. Or Sokolov. Or maybe it's the legacy. Answer me. Who is helping you? Who let you in here? You're a tough one. Even you must have your limits. And I am a patient man. Ah, okay. People are saying, um, no, you do Metal Gear Solid 4 before Peace Walker, because Peace Walker and Metal Gear Rising have um, spoilers about 4. So, fair enough. So, it, w it would be 4 for the next um, logical game, let's call it. Tiny. I got an R bat. What, what is this R bat? Vampire bat meat. Press X button to hold, release to throw. I don't want vampire bat meat. It's much smaller in my hand than what it is what he gave me. Fuck, have you, have you fucking. I'm gonna fucking. I'm, I'm gonna squeeze it through. I'm gonna squeeze it through these fucking. Hey, hey. Take your fucking rations. Oh, dude, I'm just throwing this fucking ration around the room. I'm gonna launch. Hey, oh, hey, oh, I think there's a gap in the fucking thing there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get it out. I'm gonna get it out of that fucking hole. It, 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 he's got a cold, so it's clearly, it's, it's all infected with cold lurgers. I don't want you fucking dirty vampire bat cold lurgers. I'm gonna get it through that hole. I swear to God, I'm gonna get it through that fucking hole. Maybe from about here. Yeah, fuck. Maybe a, bit, maybe a bit closer? No, too close there, I think. But... But... Halfway there. That... Maybe? It's right-handed, so that might work. Yeah! I got it out. Fuck you, Russian. Nice. There's a big fucking hole there and something to throw. I've got no else to do. Nothing under the bed? Nope. I could hide under the bed. What? You don't want this? Hey, oh. It took me Russian. I'm hungry as well. I can hear my fucking stomach growling. What the fuck are you doing here? I can't stab the wall. Can't stab the sink or the toilet, it seems. I am so sorry, rat. I am so sorry, dude. But you are the only thing that's actually, like, doable in this room. So I am gonna have to stab you, mate. We're a fork. I'm so sorry. Insta food. Oh, snake, you're right, aye, man. What are you laughing at? It's not right high, it's right eye. Oh. Snare your right high, man. <laughs> Sorry. 
I like I like the camera angle of this fork. It's like the biggest fork ever. It's like this is why I don't have an eye no more. <laughs> 